Alright guys, today I'm going to show you how to ride a ripboard. Alright, so the ripboard I'm using is a Sunshine Mountain. I'll shoot you back, get right into the frame. Alright, so today I'm going to show you how to ride one. So, stay tuned. ever and you were in it. Alright, so this is day two, as you couldn't tell as you could tell, because the sun's more out than before. But anyways, um this is um just this new series I'm making. It's called um Pen Fifteen, alright? And so basically today I'm gonna show you how to ride a ripboard. Alright, it's gonna be the first Pen Fifteen Episode. Alright. Let's get started now. So I've set up pylons. I wonder if can, you can see all those. Let's see. One, two, yeah, I can see them. Okay. Alright. And now, you're going to do it, this in four steps. Alright. So first, who is that? One second. Who is that? Alright, first, go up to here, first pylon, and get on. This is a, this is um pretty easy part, this is the easy part. So, first put your right or left foot, if you're right handed, put your right foot on the front, if you're left handed, put your left foot on the front, alright? And you need, if, so if your left foot is, I go like, or left handed, I go like this, alright, see that? But I'm right handed. So, I go in here. So next, just move your way over to step two, which is pumping. Just push, push, push. And then, I went a little early. Step three, go to your feet. Now, I think I messed step. Yeah, step three, wiggle your feet. Now, how do you wiggle your feet? Let me show you. Alright. So, take your hips and move it to the side. Take your legs, push this one out and that one in. So it goes like, see this then opposite. This way, opposite. Do that. Practice that in your living room. Just go like, see that? Do that on a board and you'll have it. So practice that three. So now I'm going to show you how to turn. I had to redo this because I wasn't close enough and I gave the wrong directions. Alright, so to uh, move to the left, take your uh, top foot and lean it left, and then your bottom foot, lean it right. That means go left. Now, if you want to uh, make your right foot, or if you want to go right, Take your top foot and lean it right, and your bottom foot and lean it left. That makes you go left. And um, now I'm gonna cut this and I'm gonna show you how to turn. Like, actually do it. You should be able to see your move. Another thing you can try doing is just leaning. Some people might find it hard to uh, actually move your feet off the directions. The trick is. Just lean. Your feet will do it automatically to keep balance. So watch. I am just going to lean. My feet will try to keep balance and do it for me. See that? Basically all you gotta do. Now, there's another way to turn as well. This one's not really recommended. You can't really do sharp turns with this way. 
But basically, you are to just shove it over. You always balance that way. But another way is to like throw your your board one to one side. See how I'm doing that? That's another way, but that's a horrible way of doing it. You slowly turn. It's not really the best. Right? So just try practicing leaning on the board. Now, just note, this is not going to be one time you're going to be able to do this. That is physically impossible. You will, you're going to fall up a couple times if you're new at this. You're not going to get on this board and ride down that road and you know, go to Mexico. You need to practice. Now, on this manual of this board, it says practice balance by going down hills. That is a good idea, actually. Do that. All right? This is Pen 15, signing out. Oh, by the way, check out my um, friend. Um, his name is Vincent T. Jokum. Is the camera even aimed at me? I can't tell. But, um, he makes awesome photography. He actually has this very nice video, about two of them. I actually helped one video. It's a really nice video. And both are pretty nice. Um, and he takes photography, but that's not the good part. The good part is that he uses um, his youth. He has a youth club, and um, he lets um take photos, you know, and then he sells them. He basically uses, he basically has little minions to hire, he hires them. Well, not hire, he he makes them join a club. I will not make, but you know, to, people join a club to take pictures and then sell them. Alright? And um, his artwork is based on faith, love, and hope. Alright? So you see, you'll see it down there, below this video, if you're on my channel. If you're not on my channel, go to my channel. And below, you'll see um, the Cool Kid Club. I don't know if it's still named that by now, but you'll see the Vincent T. Jokum underneath on my channel. The S it, right now it's called um, MSPS. Um, but underneath that, you'll see Vincent T. Jokum. Yeah, um, currently it's that guy with the black and white photo. Photo. All right, that's that's the cool guy. All right. He has awesome artwork. Check him out. He's in Calgary. And he makes awesome artwork. Or he takes awesome artwork. Or like photos, you know? And just check him out. And this is um, Pen15. Finally signing off. Signing off.